Hi guys, so today I have a polymer clay craft update for you guys and I do have quite a bit of cupcakes in this craft update just because I've been pretty obsessed with making them because they are super easy and yeah, so let's just get started. But first I'm just going to show you, uh, I'm going to start off with the first things that I made and then move on from there. So this is the first thing. And it is a ice cream on a brownie, and it has a cherry with strawberry jizzle, and the ice cream is nicely textured. And this was inspired by um, Funky Pink Gal. There's that. And then I made, um, this is actually really bad, but whatever, it's my first one. So it was a cupcake paint palette, and I think... I thought it was really cool when I first made it, but now I realize it's not that good. So I remade one uh, a lot smaller using my tiny cupcakes. So this is what it looks like. It's a lot better compared to this. So this is way more suitable for a necklace charm. Um, then I made some... The rest of them are basically all cupcakes, I think, so, yeah. Then I made this burger cupcake, and I really like this one. I think it's pretty cool. But I ran out of yellow, so I couldn't make the cheese. And then I made a bigger hamburger cupcake, just because I wanted to see the size comparison. And that's the difference. And then I made um, a macaron. That's the only non-cupcake thing I have. And I really like it. It's my first macaron in a really long time. So I think I've improved a lot since my last macaron. Um, then I have some autumn cupcakes. And they were inspired by a sweet tutorials tutorial that I watched a long time ago but they're not exactly the same so this is the first one I made and as you can see it's really detailed it has a leaf and sprinkles and I really like the base too and then I made two others so I have this one here and this one they're not as good as the first one but I still like them then I made um, a different style of cupcake charms. So I'm just looking through them here. So the first one is this one. And these two are fails, by the way. Um, so I have a pink one and a mint one, and they just have chocolate bits. These are fails. And then I made a bunch that are a whole much, a whole bunch better. So let me just grab all of them. So these are all the ones that I made. And this is how I'm planning on packaging them. So I'm going to make them into little charms with lobster clasps. And so this is a pink one. And it just has sprinkles. And I made three pink ones. So I have this one. This one. And this one. And then I have four mint ones. The reason why I have seven of each of my cupcake styles, because, or I will at least, because I'm going to have um, some one on display and then six for sale. So I'll have one mint on display. So here are the mint cupcakes. I like these a lot better. So um, then I have some a style of cupcakes that I've never attempted before. So it's not amazing, but I think it's pretty good. I really do like it. And um, they're out of the cupcake wrapper. These are like confetti cupcakes, so they have the little pieces bits and stuff so this is the first one I made 
and they're in really nice and textured because if you took a cupcake out of the wrapper it would look like that and this one has white frosting and sprinkles and as you can see they have the little pieces in there to resemble the confetti cake there's that one and I have three whites so these are the other two and then I have two chocolate ones um, and yeah, this is just what they look like. Hopefully I can get a tutorial on these soon. And then I have these two cupcakes. But I like the white ones the best. For some reason, I don't know why. And then I have two red velvet cupcakes, and those are my last cupcakes. Um... I failed at the first one, and my second one is pretty good, in my opinion. Uh, so the first one is just like this, and it's the out-of-the-wrapper style. And it's not too bad, but it's pretty much a fail because the strawberry is way too small. Because if you think about it, strawberries are pretty big. They're like that big, and cupcakes aren't that big. So strawberries would not be that tiny on a cupcake. And... I don't know, I just don't like it. It's kind of a fail. So the second one I made, maybe I made the strawberry a little big on this, but I still like it. So, um, I like it a lot better. Um, it has, um, it, this time it's in the wrapper, which I like. And it has a leaf on the side and the strawberry. You can't really see the dots that I made because the camera is not wanting to pick them up that well, but... They are clearly seen, and it just has white frosting, and I really like that. Alright guys, so that is everything I have for this craft update. Thank you guys so much for watching, and please comment, rate, and subscribe. Also check out my Instagram, which is tinypanya, and everything in this video is for sale, and I also do custom orders, so please email me, kick me, or DM me on YouTube or DM me on Instagram to order and all the links and stuff for that will be in the description box. Also check out my Etsy if you want to buy some awesome molds. So yeah, that's it. Bye guys.